trip into Manhattan today to pick up some prints from Adorama. We've got an upcoming art show at an event called Pancakes and Booze. It is just how it sounds. It's at a bar, so there's booze, and they serve pancakes all night long. Went to the event last year, it was really cool. Hung out, met some great artists, had some pancakes, drank some booze. So I applied for it. Uh, I was accepted to it. This will be my first art show. But in order to do it, I obviously have to have prints to sell. So I've tested out a lot of various labs and I found out that I really like Adorama. Uh, their prices are really good. I love the fact that I can go pick up the prints. That way they're flatly laid, they're not rolled into a tube. So when it comes time to frame them, uh, they go really good. So yeah, I'm just uh, running to pick up some of the last prints and then uh, head back to Brooklyn with them, get back before rush hour and start framing them up. that simple dip in it takes me longer to get here and get back than it does get the prints but like I said they pack them up really nicely everything's really secure I'm in control of them I don't have to worry about the uh, USPS shipping them I've ordered a bunch of prints before and had them come the print quality was great but in the process of them shipping through the mail they get a kink in them or something like that once they're kinked I can't do anything with them and it's not the fault of the print lab, it's the fault of the USPS. So I switched over to Adorama, I come into the city, I pick them up, I'm in control of them from that point on. So now, back to Brooklyn. <laughs> So, why start vlogging now? Why after three years living in New York would I pick up a camera and decide to start vlogging? Well, it's pretty simple. Over the next three to six months, there's some pretty big things that could be happening in my wife and my life. So, I want to document it. Think of it like a video diary. I'll share it with the public. If people like it and people get information out of it, great. But it's mainly for us. So I figured I'd pick up the camera and start vlogging. Give my try at it and what's the worst that can happen? It sucks and nobody watches it. And then all that's left is a, a video diary for my wife and I. 